on a Thursday here, kickoff of Forest Festival is this afternoon at 4 with the uh, carnival that's going to be uh, available for everybody to go up there, ride the rides, and have a whole heck of a lot of fun. Spencer, good morning to good you, sir. Good morning. Good morning. Got some awesome guests in here with us right now. We should have dressed up a little bit more. We got royalty know, yeah. <laughs> amongst our presence here. <laughs> Queen of the Forest, Jillian Abbey is here, and Bryce mm -hmm. Dady, who is Paul Bunyan uh, this year. Morning, y'all. How you guys doing? Good. How are doing you? Doing pretty good. Thanks morning. for coming on, talking with us. Yeah, thanks for having us. So, uh, Coronation, we went back and did some quick r research, and it was March 10th-ish mm -hmm. that you guys uh, uh, were uh, crowned and honored to be Paul Bunyan as well. Mm -hmm. And since then... Uh, whirlwind for you. Talk to me a little yeah. bit about what it's been like to represent Forest Festival, Mason County. You guys have been going everywhere. Mm -hmm. It's It's been really awesome so far. We've been in two parades. We went to Squim and Port Townsend. Those were really, really fun. Um, we did a bunch of speaking engagements with some of the service clubs around here, Aquanus, Rotary, everything, which those are awesome. Did elementary school visits this last week. Oh, wow. Yeah, those were my favorite thing to do, actually. We visited Pioneer and Evergreen and Southside. We got to talk to the kids about Forest Festival. And yeah, so it's been really awesome so far. Most of the kids uh, kind of understand you as royalty mm -hmm. and understand what it means for Forest Festival in the community. Mm -hmm. Yep. You won't believe how many kids accused my hard hat of being fake. <laughs> really? Oh, yeah. What did they think it was? I don't know, plastic or something, but it's full <laughs> metal. It's a, it's <laughs> a I let them feel it and they're like, oh my gosh, it is. That's awesome. <laughs> yeah. Um, when you are out representing Forest Festival in Mason County at Squim or Port Townsend mm -hmm. and you guys are on your float that you're winning huge awards for, mm -hmm. what's that like as uh, I understand, you know, you know, the home crowd mm -hmm. and they're going to cheer for you for sure. Mm -hmm. uh, but when you're out and about, uh, what's it like to get the reception that you guys get? It's been really cool. Um, I was really nervous for the first parade. I didn't really know what to expect because this is my first year. So I wasn't on court last year or anything. So coming into this completely new and just seeing the reception of Mason County and other communities, we get people and our float comes by and they're like, Mason County, woo. And it's just really cool to see um, that like recognition and respect in other communities. And it's been really cool to go learn more about other communities and be part of their festivals too. Does the float change at all? Or is it what you've seen at the mm. other... Um, parades is that what we're going to see on saturday mm -hmm. yes yeah so it'll be the same um our float designer rachel loving foss she's awesome we have a really amazing float i love it there's diamonds all over it the big trees and everything we have a replica of tolly so it's a really great float we're really grateful for it that's awesome mm -hmm. yeah pretty cool you guys are uh, also uh, being honored at the colonial house mm -hmm. uh, for, yep. for the work you're doing here and what's uh after this more uh, parades like Lake Fair, mm -hmm. you go up yep. to Seattle for yeah, Seafair. For Seafair. And all that yep. stuff. Mm -hmm. You get to spend a whole weekend in Seattle. Yeah. Go on Friday, come back Sunday. Mm -hmm. That's awesome. That's yeah, fun. we'll be in Forks for the 4th of July parade there too, so that'll be different. Oh, that's a big one. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So it'll be really cool. Our summer, it's mostly parades after this, yeah. Sounds like a cool schedule. What mm -hmm. do you talk to the service groups about? So what we did, we had a presentation. We made up a whole board and everything. And what we really focused on was our community involvement because they obviously know about Forest Festival and the events and who we are as royalty. But what we really focused on was how we're representing and, you know, giving back to our community here too and not just going to parades and, you know, representing in other cities. What's next for you guys? Jillian, looks like uh, in your description here, you say you would like to be a teacher mm -hmm. back here in the county. Yeah. So I'm going to Whitworth University in the fall. I'm going to get my degree probably in elementary education. Really love elementary school. Um, and my goal really is to come back teach in Mason County. I love this community and my teachers are really the ones who made all the difference for me. So I want to do the same thing. Fantastic. South Puget yeah. Sound for you, Bryce. And then a very specific... <laughs> career goal i like it yes i would like to be the service manager at toyota of olympia mm -hmm. wow that's cool got it Isn't, all planned out i mean that is that's called real seeing yeah. the goal mm -hmm. there's people yeah. my age that aren't that specific good for you no really <laughs> that's that good awesome? having your eye on the ball so mm -hmm. you go to south puget sound they have mm -hmm. a good program right automotive yeah mm -hmm. it's actually my auto teacher mike buyer that inspired me to want to be a service manager there because mm -hmm. he's actually the retired service manager there what is it about Mike then? Tell us about him. He sounds like a great teacher. He honestly is such a great guy. He even went out with me when I went to buy a car to do an MPI on it to make sure that I had a well-running car. And 
he didn't accept any money. My parents tried to pay him for it, and he said it was too good of a learning opportunity to take money for. Wow. Mm -hmm. How about that? That's really cool. That's touching. That's nice. Mm -hmm. That's a good story right there. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So you guys will be at Hand the, me the Kleenex, will you please? <laughs> if I don't cry first, you will. I know. So uh, unfortunately, because uh, it's kind of the home parade, you're mm -hmm. uneligible or ineligible to uh, win any of the hardware uh, mm -hmm. this upcoming. But hopefully, you get a chance to look around at mm -hmm. least and talk with the folks as yeah. Yep. You make it through. Yeah, definitely. So before the parade, um, we'll be by the float, so kids can come by. We'll take pictures with them, talk to community members and stuff like that, um, and then other courts will be getting judged for their floats and everything and which is really exciting for us anyway we've met a lot of the other royalty members and they're really cool so we're excited to see who wins the prizes and who gets recognized for their floats at our festival just like we've been recognized so, that's awesome yeah that's great forest festival royalty court in here with us today jillian the queen of the forest you'll mm -hmm. see her at the parade and all around town you won't miss her she's got the sash mm -hmm. that says queen of the forest mm -hmm. and bryce is uh, paul bunyan this year well thanks for um being a part of the whole coronation uh the deal and getting involved in forest festival it's a lot of extra work that you guys put into this yeah, to definitely. represent us well across the state totally worth it it's been a huge commitment but mm -hmm. i wouldn't pass up this opportunity so for upcoming potential um timbers and pauls mm -hmm. you say go for it and for upcoming potential queens mm -hmm. and uh, princesses you say go for it oh definitely yeah this has been one of my favorite things i've done in high school and i've been involved in a lot so i definitely recommend anybody who sees this and wants to be part of it even if you're nervous coronation they help you out so much and so i really encourage anybody who's interested just to try and put yourself out there because it's been one of the most meaningful experiences for me that was a fun night doing yeah that with you guys mm -hmm. well thanks for coming in thank you. yeah we'll thanks for having the us parade route. So